Arctic ice refers to the ice that forms in the Arctic region, which is located around the North Pole. The Arctic is home to vast amounts of sea ice, which is frozen seawater. By the way, do you guys know why the U.S. Navy came here? Then, why the Navy punches a sub through Arctic ice? The Arctic region holds a mystical allure with its breathtaking landscapes and extreme conditions. It's also a strategic hiding spot for submarines due to the cover provided by sea ice. This makes them nearly impossible to detect from the air, making the Arctic an ideal location for covert operations. ISEX, aka ice exercise, is a series of training exercises conducted by the United States Navy in the Arctic region. ISEX is designed to enhance the Navy's operational capabilities in icy environments and to improve its understanding of the Arctic's unique challenges. The primary objective of ISEX is to train and test the Navy's submarines in the extreme cold and ice-covered waters of the Arctic. The exercises offer valuable opportunities for submarine crews to practice operating in challenging conditions, such as surfacing through ice, conducting under-ice navigation, and performing simulated combat missions. The U.S. Navy has been conducting ISEX exercises since the 1950s, with a few interruptions over the years. The exercises have evolved over time to adapt to changing technologies and environmental conditions. One of the interesting points in this exercise is submarines. The sea ice acts as a barrier. I know you guys often see a sub punch through the ice, right? Breaking through the Arctic ice is a remarkable feat that requires immense power and precision. Submarines are designed with reinforced hulls and powerful propulsion systems capable of exerting incredible force. These vessels use their sheer weight and momentum to break through the ice, creating a dramatic sight as they burst into the open water. The submarines employ various techniques to break the ice. Some use their hull's shape to ride up onto the ice and then allow their weight to crack through the surface. One of the primary reasons for punching through the ice is to establish communication channels. Underneath the ice, submarines face significant difficulties in maintaining contact with their bases or other friendly forces. By using their sheer power and strength, submarines can create openings in the ice, allowing antennas and communication devices to extend above the surface. Then, in certain scenarios, Submarines might encounter hostile targets or engage in strategic operations where the deployment of missiles becomes necessary. These subs are equipped with sophisticated missile systems that can be deployed from beneath the surface. By breaking through the ice, submarines gain access to a clear line of sight, enabling them to launch missiles accurately and effectively towards their intended targets. Well, that's all for today's video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episode.